the lot, told him for a 12 fuck swat Buzzing all the bells out the box, I just hit a lick with the box Had to put the stick in the box What's the tea, honey bees? It's your girl, your Judy, your boy, Gabe, aka Cutie from Keeping It G100. Make sure y'all click that subscribe button, hit that like button, hit that comment button, every button that you can basically hit on this page. Hit that shit! Okay. <laughs> So I am here for another episode of Cooking with Cutie. Y'all see me, I am in my kitchen, honey, okay, honey. So we are actually going to be cooking today. We're making a turkey chili with rice and beans. I'm so excited, this is gonna be so good. And I'm gonna make a vegetarian cornbread. So we have all of our things here, honey, okay? We got cute little ingredients. Um, we got our peppers, you know, we got our onions, we got our garlic, you know, we got our green peppers, honey. We got our tomatoes, honey, okay? Where the onions at? Oh, hold on, the onions are here. Hold on, hold on. We got the onions, okay? We got the onions, okay? So we gonna uh, have a few things. We gonna show y'all how to make some turkey chili, okay? Well, my way of making turkey chili, okay? Well, not really my... Y'all know I looked it up online and not just, you know, a recipe. So we gonna look up the recipe of how to make this turkey chili with rice and beans. The first things that we gonna have to do... So, what they're saying is I have to basically, like, chop everything up. Chop all these up and, you know, um, basically what I have to first do is chop all these up. Then I have to uh, put some oil in the skillet or in this bowl, in a large bowl. Where's my bowl at? You see the bowl? Okay. In a large bowl, I have to put some uh, onions. I think. Is that what that shit say? What the fuck that bitch say? Hold on, y'all. Ah, damn shit. <laughs> Ah, yes. So, yes, in a large pot, I'm going to have to put some toaster garlic for like 30 seconds and then I put the onions and all that. So, I'm going to cut all these up real quick. I'm not going to stay with y'all with me cutting these up. So, I'm going to cut these up and then I will catch y'all when I'm about to, you know, start the whole cooking and all that shit. All right? So, catch y'all in a few. All right, y'all. So, we are back. We got everything all chopped up. Got the tomatoes chopped up. Got the... Green peppers, red peppers, onions, got the um, garlic all minced up. You know, I had to use uh, the Haitian way, honey, okay, with the pillow, honey, okay. And then, so what we have to do now, um, got my beans. I actually overnight soaked my beans. These black things are actually cloves. Um, Mika, a.k.a. my mom, thought that I was making Haitian rice for dinner. So this morning, <laughs> she was like, oh, let me put some cloves in there. Come to find out I'm not even making Haitian rice. But we're going to keep those in there because cloves actually kind of brings um, stuff a little bit more flavor. It's like, I think it's like a West Indian thing. I don't really know. So we're going to leave those cloves in there. Well, we're going to take the beans out of the water and we're going to wash it and all of that shit. So we're actually not going to leave the clothes in there. But anyway, so after we take the beans out, we wash her and all of that. We're going to uh, take these, the minced garlic and we're going to put it into some oil. We're going to heat it on up. So stay tuned for that, y'all. I'll be right back. All right, y'all. So we are back. So y'all hear her sizzling and bizzling, honey, okay? So... What we have to do now is I'm about to put this garlic in her so she can, um, that just said toast. Is that what it said? Uh-huh, toast until fragrant for like 30 seconds. So I feel like I'm yelling because like y'all don't hear me. <laughs> but yes, honey, I'm coming. So we about to toast her up. Yes. I don't know about y'all about cooking, but I love to listen to music while I cook, honey. Okay, so. Okay. We did it. What you do? Has it been 30 seconds? Okay, I don't think so. So then what it says, after the onions and all of that, oh, not the onions. After the garlic has been in here for about 30 seconds, what we do is we add... We're gonna add the onions and the peppers and all of that so it can also get sauteed as well. So, 
Here we are. I don't know about, uh, also, I'm about to say, I don't know about y'all again, but a bitch like me, I don't like washing a whole bunch of dishes. So, <laughs> so like, I will use a minimal amount of dishes as possible. So, okay. So now we're just saying to, like, just let her cook for a few minutes. Yes, honey, yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. So it say the saute. Oh shit! I forgot to cut my ground turkey and get my water. Okay. So whole time this thing is asking for two cups of water. So let me get my water. Time I forgot to put this water. Okay, and then it said to get a, a pound of um a pound of meat. This is about two pounds, whole time. This is like two pounds of meat, whole time. But we're gonna cut her in half. I'm a little ratchet, so we just gonna cut her right. Oh yes, yes, honey. Okay, you real easy. Yup, yup. Y'all, y'all, that's how you do that. Y'all, 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 okay. Y'all, y'all, okay. She's saying to saute these onions and peppers, honey. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Damn, that was a big-ass piece of pepper. Shit. <laughs> I didn't cut these all the way. <laughs> I felt like I was like Russian. Okay, so the seasonings that I'm gonna be using, I got some coming so from ShopRite. You know, I got some coming from ShopRite, y'all. Okay, here go the coming. Okay, what else am I using? We are using, um, I'm actually gonna use some of this. Okay, it's, yeah, chili lime. We're gonna use some chili lime for the meat, to season the meat, some chili pepper. This my shit hard. Sorry, y'all. Okay. What's it? New Keisha. Fire. Okay. What else we? Use? <laughs> we using the people's Mrs. Dash. This is all the seasons that we gonna be using for this chili. Um. Yep. Just these three. Salt and pepper, of course. Got to do some salt, okay? All right. Keep on stirring her just so she can make sure that it's just all, all cooked and sauteed, I guess. Wanna try? Hey! Ha! What's it say? What's it say? <laughs> Fuck fucking around and burn myself. So after this is all sauteed and stuff, we're gonna put the um, ground beef in. So I guess we just gonna wait. You, you would have had to finally see that. Hey. He don't wanna. Ah, shit. Okay, good. <clears throat> okay, y'all. So we are back. So we now about to put in this beef. I know it look a little frozen, but you know it ain't frozen. <laughs> we about to put this beef. This uh, it's not beef. We about to put this ground turkey in into this um pot, and then we about to let it uh obviously cook. Okay. So it's saying for us to let it cook until. You gotta let it cook until it's brown. So we're gonna let it cook until it's brown and it is a little frozen. So we gonna let it cook until it's brown, brown, honey, okay? So, <laughs> so that's gonna be a little minute for it to be brown, brown. So we gonna let it cook until it's brown, brown. All the juices, you know, 
transform into the veggies. You know, because I ended up, usually some people don't, I don't know about some people, but a lot of people don't put like peppers and all of that. They usually just put like the tomato and then the onions and some garlic. But I decided because I, you know, I'm trying to make this as healthy as possible. I put some tomatoes in there. I put some onions in there. I put all those stuff in there. So um, a little bit more vegetables so we can make it more veggie. And um, I decided not to use beef. I decided to use ground turkey because obviously that's better. So, you know, we trying to get this, you know, I'm, you know, I'm trying to, you see this little body, you see, okay, you, you know, we try to, we try to let it a little, you know, give a little, you know, so we got to eat right, eat right, get right, right body for you to throw it back. And my last, you know, the one for Baltimore, you know, you got to throw it back for your right man, but you got to look right when you're throwing it back, honey. And I was just telling my trainer that I want that little, uh, I got that little, uh, right now at this point, I got that little, uh, what's that? You know, when you have like that little line on your back, you know, I got that little line on your back where, you know, if you got like something dripping on your back, it just goes right down, honey. Okay. You know, I, that's what I, you know, that's what I wanted. I wanted that line on your back, honey, okay? Give me that line. That's what I want. <laughs> this damn shit was... I done put this beef in the... I done, Why do I keep calling this beef? <laughs> I done put this ground turkey in the, um, in the fridge to thaw out because I knew I wasn't going to use all of the ground turkey. So I was like, let me to pick, um, let me put it in the fridge because if you have put your ground turkey, if I had put all the ground turkey outside to like thaw out, then I wouldn't be able to put it back in. But what I read on Google, if you had put it in the fridge and let it thaw out, you can put the rest back in the fridge. Whatever you don't use, you could put it in the freezer. So that's what I'm going to do. Thank God. So yeah. So, but the thing is, I had put it in the, I had taken it out yesterday and, or last night, and I'm thinking that it's going to be thawed out in the fridge. My dumb ass, shit still ain't even thawed out. Look at this. Lord, so I guess we're going to have to work this out. Let me. Hey! All right, let me put a little elbow grease in this. Oh, here we go. All right, now we talk. Now we cooking. All right, yes, beef separate, separation. Late night phone calls on the telephone. Yes, give me the separation. Yes, yes. Give me the separation, please. All right, so now she's finally separated. Thank God for Jesus. So now we're waiting for her to not be as pink. We're waiting for it to cook for it to not be pink. Okay. And I'm also going to season her as well while she's cooking. Say you will be Oh, this damn Lord Jesus. <laughs> I'm like second guessing. I feel like I should have cooked this shit. I should have thawed this out outside. Or thawed it out like, you know, out. You know what I mean, like at room temperature. <laughs> okay, so she coming together. She giving me a little color. She giving me a little color. Yes, give me a little brownish, okay? A little brownish. Not blackish, honey. A little brownish, honey, okay? A little brownish. <laughs> okay, so now we're about to season her real quick as we mix. Okay, so we're going to put this, I don't know, so we're going to put this chili powder in. Chili powder. Ba, ba, ba. I don't know if that was too much, but you know, we're going to do that. So then, we're going to use this cumin. Okay. Come on, coming. This is a brand new. Oh! Oh! What the fuck? What is this? I'm not even going to put too much of this because I don't know what this is. Alright, I think.
All right, that's enough. Right? All right. It, it ain't really coming. All right, that's enough. That's enough. <laughs> Got some Mrs. Dash. Okay, the people's Mrs. Dash. This chili lime. Oh, shit. Damn, this is a... I thought this had a damn joint. This don't even got a joint. All right. <laughs> I did wash my hands, y'all. Okay, always remember. Wash your damn hands, bitch, because that shit nasty as fuck. Okay. <laughs> We mix all this together. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Okay. She ain't really smelling too, too bad. I don't know about it. Add some salt. Add some salt, maybe a little pepper. I'm gonna add some garlic powder as well. Some garlic powder. Ooh, that was a little too much. Ooh, chat. <laughs> okay. Black pepper. Um, what else did I say? Okay, I think that's going to be it. <laughs> so mix it all together. It says mix well, so we're going to mix so well, honey, okay? So mix them all together. Did I put the salt in? Yep, I put salt and pepper in. So after we mix this all together, guys, we put some tomatoes in. Now we put the tomatoes in. And then we let that cook for a few minutes. So here are my tomatoes. Add her in, honey. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. I feel like this pot might be too small. My chili, damn. Cause as I keep adding stuff, I'm like, ooh, let's get a little higher and higher. Okay, so we gonna let this sit for about three to four minutes, just so the um, tomatoes can like, you know, roast, not roast, but like cook and stuff. So like, we gonna let this sit for like about two to three minutes, just so it can roast. Why do I keep saying roast? Just so it can sit and cook. And then at that moment in time, then we're going to add the rice and all of that. So while we wait for that, I'm actually going to start prepping for the cornbread. So I'm about to start getting all my stuff together for the cornbread. So, so the things that you basically need for the people's uh, cornbread. Well, if you don't know how to make no damn jiffy. I, this is actually my first time making some cornbread. So, I mean, this is a first for me. But we are actually using the vegetarian jiffy, honey. Okay. So, because like I said, a bitch is trying to be healthy. So, I'm like one of those bitches that like, you know those people that everything that's like vegetarian is going to be healthy. So, like, I'm like one of those people like, oh, it's vegetarian? Oh, it's going to be healthy. So, let me get some vegetarian cornbread so I can use it for my vegetarian. Well, it's, this ain't really vegetarian. It's kind of big. No, it ain't. It's not vegetarian. But this chili is, you know, it's going, like I said, it's healthy. So, like, you know, yeah. So, anyway, so, you know, if you don't know how to make the people's jiffy like me, you needed one third of a people's uh, milk, okay? Now, um, I ran out of my Khalifa almond milk, so I just used the 2% milk. So, you know, we used the 2% milk, a package of this, and an egg. Okay, you know, got the egg. Okay, 
So we go, pop, crack the egg open. Okay, 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 okay. Then, obviously, you know, put the. All right, okay. Put the milk in. What else you say? Oh damn! I should have. Okay, well I'll do that. Blend ingredients. It was telling me to grease the pan, but I'm actually gonna put the corn cornbread in my toaster oven in here because I don't feel like using my oven. That's, you know, my mom like puts like all of like the pots and pans and all that. Y'all know that mamas that be putting all the pots and pans in the stove. Then you gotta take it out the oven. Then you know you gotta put it back in the oven. I ain't got time for all that. So I'm just gonna make this cornbread right in this um right in this toaster oven. So yeah, so we gonna take this one. And yes, the um damn, I feel like it has been over two minutes. How time? <laughs> three, four minutes. I was gonna say it has probably been three, four minutes that this thing hasn't uh ah shit. Well it's fine, I guess. Because then all I have to do after that is, um, after adding the tomatoes and letting it simmer for letting it cook, I had to, um, I got to add the rice and stuff. So let me at least put this in, okay, and stir her. <laughs> Damn, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot to take for So we're going to stir her up, okay? I told y'all, know I'm up, y'all already know I'm, uh, Cutie Crocker, honey, okay? So, y'all know this is easy for me, this baking stuff. All right, all right. So, you know, you just gotta, you know, mix it together until, you know, she's no longer lumpy and shit. All right, so let me, you know, we, she can she can wait for a little bit because we gotta focus on this. So, what's going on, Chili? How you looking? How you giving? What you giving? How you looking? What you doing? Okay. I gotta feel like I need to season it a little bit more. You know what? I'm gonna use this total seasoning. Because I don't think it's seasoned enough. It ain't smelling like, you know, it ain't smelling like, oh. You know what I'm saying? It ain't giving me like the, oh, it smelled good. It just smelled like turkey. <laughs> okay. okay, there we go. That's what it needed. There we go. Let me, hold time, should I add some more? No, because you don't want to over season your food. That is true. Should I add some more chili powder? Maybe I didn't put enough chili powder. Make it a little spicy. Then I guess a little bit more. Well, no, the cook, the cook, the common don't need that much. Yes, yes, okay. Now she coming together. Now she coming together, honey. Okay. That's all she needed. Just a little bit more seasoning. There we go. Now we talking. Now we talking, honey. Okay. So. Now it's telling me to add the rice and the beans. And then we're going to make it into a mixture to boil. So here's the rice. We'll add that. The beans. Then we're going to let it cook. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and we're going to add some water. Okay. So then we're going to mix them all together. All right. So we're gonna mix these all together.
Okay, y'all. So I got a quick question because I done um <laughs> I had called my friend Marty to ask her if she like you know ever made like chili before, and then because the, the the recipe that I got it don't say nothing about like covering my um covering the the pot while it's cooking and boiling and stuff while it's you know cooking everything up. So I had to call my friend real quick and be like, hey girl, you I know you made chili before. Does it need to be covered, you know, for all that time? So I told her the ingredients that was that I'm making the chili with. I was like, hey, I'm making like, you know, chili with like turkey. <laughs> I said turkey meat, but like it's y'all know it's ground turkey. So I told her it was gonna be like turkey and like, you know, rice and beans. She said rice. <laughs> y'all ain't never hear turkey, I mean chili with rice before? Y'all don't pip Rice in y'all chili? Am I the only one? Listen, I went on Google and I asked for chili with rice and beans and turkey beef. So, I mean, turkey, uh, ground turkey. <laughs> I don't know why I keep saying beef. But yes, and you know, this is what it gave me. So this is what we gonna call it. We gonna call it Cutie's Chili. Okay, and that's probably gonna be the title of this goddamn show. Cutie's Chili. Okay, I'm here for it. Cuties turkey chili. Okay, come get it. So anyway, so we gonna let this simmer. I'm, we going back to let it simmer for 45 minutes. <laughs> All right, y'all. So the chili is still being uh, cooked, I guess. You know, it's boiling and shit. <laughs> My thing is, how do I know when it's ready? Like, what exactly does chili look like? Like, I know it like it's supposed to look like like kind of like stewish. But I know it's not supposed to be like too soupy. So, and then on top of that, I put rice in it. So like, <laughs> the Haitian in me is just gonna, <laughs> it's just gonna like cook it until like the rice is like you know cooked. And plus, like, I, there's beans in there as well. So like, I feel like I'm gonna leave it in there for a little while. But anyway, I say all of that to say, I'm not about to make this cornbread. So. I already got the pan. This is my little baking pan that we use it for right now because I don't think the cornbread is going to be too necessary to be using a big pan. So it is, it is say that it's supposed to be a little lumpy. So she does give the lumps. Okay, my rumps and my bumps. Okay, rump, lump, lump. So, so we just add this in here and then we're going to have to bake her for about 20 minutes. So that's what we're about to do. So anyway, so we about to put this in here real quick and then we'll, we're gonna um, let her bake for about 20 minutes and we're gonna see how it looks. When it comes back, hopefully it looks good. <laughs> this is part of my dinner. <laughs> All right, so. I wanna take every last little piece because this looks like this, uh, I hope this rises. Is this gonna rise? I feel like it's gonna rise. Cause it's bread. It's bread! Duh. Bread rises. That's, you know, sometimes you gotta say things out loud <laughs> for it to make sense. I say that all the time. You know, sometimes you just gotta say things and then you know, oh. Cause, you know, sometimes I be saying some dumb <laughs> By the way, the chili smells like, I'm going to be honest, <laughs> the chili kind of smells like cloves, because like I said, my mom thought that I was making like regular rice, and like Haitians, where they make regular rice, or like brown rice with beans, they put cloves in it just to give it a little bit of flavor. So it smells like cloves with like seasonings and all of that, so it's not like that it smells bad. I just really mainly smell the cloves, and I see the cloves, so I'm kind of like, ugh. What the fuck? Oh, you know what I should try to maybe put? A pima. Maybe I should put a hot pepper to give it some. Hold up. Do we have hot peppers? Tell me we do. I don't know if we do. Uh... Oh, damn. Ugh, annoying. Never mind, guys. No hot peppers. All right, so we're about to put this in the oven. 
let her bake for about 20 minutes. Right? Hopefully that's a baking pan. I think I've seen my mama use it. So I would assume that it would be a baking pan because I think I've seen her put it. That looked like a baking pan. Don't it look like one of the pans that you be making casserole and shit? Like, you know, you be making casserole and shit out of, right? Look like a pan to me. Hey, all right, we're 20 minutes and then we catch y'all. <laughs> all right, y'all, so we are back. It's been about 20, 15, 20 minutes, so I'm sure the chili is ready. Let's take a look. Yes. Um, I guess, is this... Gotta look like just some jambalaya to me. <laughs> this don't really look like chili. Is this what chili's supposed to look like? Okay, well, it's ready. <laughs> so. And then let's take a look at this cornbread. Then we got this cornbread. I got the cornbread. Cornbread the whole time look a little burnt. Ah, oh, damn. I just, I'm just fucking up with this meal. This ain't the good. <laughs> Lord. All right, well, let's, uh, I'm about to make my little plate. And then we gonna taste, have a little taste test real quick. All right, so stay tuned. <laughs> I don't know what the hell I just did. <laughs> I usually have before it don't really look like this I think it's because of the fact that I wanted like rice in it like I was like let's get some rice that's probably why it looks like this but you know what we gonna try it so let's see how it is I'm gonna try it with the cornbread so okay so this is what it look like okay all that steam all that beam it smells good, you know. Okay. Hold on. I mean, I'm gonna eat it. <laughs> I mean, it's not like wild tat out, watch out now. The whole time it needs some salt. Okay. <laughs> you know, this is really some rice. Okay. <laughs> you know what? This is no longer cuties chili. This is now cuties jambalaya. Okay. Actually, this is cuties, rice and beans with turkey meat. Okay. <laughs> and some vegetables. Okay. <laughs> this is what it is now. All right. Well, I guess this... this here we have it. <laughs> y'all, make sure that y'all like, subscribe, comment. Do everything that y'all have to do and put a message in a bottle on this message. I'm about to enjoy this little meal because I done made it, so I'm going to eat it. And I'm going to have it for lunch tomorrow. Okay. Okay, so see y'all next week, y'all. Get out. Yeah, you got that yummy, yum, the yummy, yum, the yummy, yummy. Yeah, you got that yummy.